Hello everyone, welcome to Spiritual Butterfly. So today I will be doing a general reading for the sign of Scorpio. These messages will not resonate with everyone. I ask that you take what does, apply it, and leave the rest. Also remember to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and click the notification bell in order to receive notifications when I post. So let's jump right into it and see what messages Spirit has for you. So Spirit, what messages do you have for Scorpio? What is going on with Scorpio? I have strength and I have the two of cups. So let's get some more messages. I have the Knight of Cups in the reverse. Tink song, Treat Me Like Somebody. Just came to me. I want somebody to treat me like somebody. And I have the fool. Okay. I feel like Some of you are ready to move forward when it comes to a relationship. I heard like failed attempts. So it's like in the past with this Knight of Cups, you didn't get what you wanted when it came to connections. I heard fleeting. So a lot of these connections that you had, they were not sustainable. You know, maybe you would go out with this person for you know, one or two dates, and then after that, you would never hear from them again, or you just wouldn't click, and things wouldn't move forward. You wouldn't see any progress progression when it came to these past connections. Yes, it's like things would end before they even got started, and I just feel like I just heard looking for love. Like for some of you, you're looking for love, and it's like you're ready to really move forward and have the connection that you've always desired. And I heard meet someone or meeting someone. So it's like for some of you, you may be getting ready to meet someone and it's like you are going to be fully invested into this new connection because you are ready. Like you're just ready to be committed. You're ready to settle down. Yes, it's like season. Spirit says season. It's like this is your season to get what you want when it comes to romantic connections. For others of you, Spirit says already. So I feel like you've already met this person and you're just ready to go full throttle and completely give to the situation. Yes, because it's like, I just keep going back to this Knight of Cups in the reverse. It's like things that you have experienced in the past were, were very fleeting. They were just very fleeting relationships. I heard one night stands. For some of you, you had a lot of one night stands and it was nothing that was ever stable, nothing solid. And it's like you finally met someone that you're willing to open up to, that you're willing to give to. So let's get some more messages. Spirit, give me a message for strength. I have the three of cups in the reverse. Yeah, I feel like you, I just feel like past. Like in the past, you definitely did not get the fulfillment that you wanted. It's like the, your relationships were not able to fully come together. Things never worked out. It was just always something. I heard like hiccups. Like it was really, and I'm thinking of like a car, like you purchasing like a new car. Maybe someone recently brought a new car and it's like you're having a lot of mechanical problems with it. That's just like a side message. It's like one thing after another. But just in terms of relationships, um, a car you just brought and you think like, okay, this is it. This is a car of my dreams. 
and then one week something goes wrong and then the next week something else goes wrong and then the third week is something else so it's like you thought that this was going to be you know your dream car but it turned out to give you a lot of problems and so that is what a lot of you were going through it's like you thought that the people you were meeting um, were going to be people that you could invest in but there always seemed to be something that stopped the relationship from moving forward. It, it was always a challenge that presented itself. So let's get a message for the Two of Cups. I have the Seven of Cups in the reverse. I feel like for some of you right now, you don't see any options when it comes to being in a relationship. It's like you don't really have any suitable, um, any you don't feel that there's anyone in your life right now that is suitable for you to fully give to, to commit to. I feel like for others of you, this is like you... Yeah, giving up your options. It's like letting go, no longer searching. It's like you found the one that you wanted to be with. You found the one that you want to commit to. So let's get a message for the Knight of Cups. And yeah, Spirit says you found the one. So yes, you have given up searching. You're no longer looking. You're no longer searching for anyone because you already have the person that you desire. I have the wheel in the reverse. Yeah, I feel like you did not get what you wanted. When it came to a lot of past connections, Scorpio. But Spirit says the tables have turned. Yes, the tables have finally turned. You're finally in a season where you are getting ready to meet someone or you just recently met someone that has the potential to be your divine counterpart, that has the potential to give you the fulfillment that you want. So let's get a message for the fool. And I'm just getting like a picture of a train. I heard travel. So maybe some of you are going to meet this person while you're traveling. And then also Spirit says with the train, it's like it's coming, it's coming, it's getting closer. It's like you are getting ready to meet this person. Like that timing is becoming closer. You're getting ready to meet the person of your dreams. I have the hermit, yes. It's like you're ready. You're ready to move forward. You're ready for a commitment, whether you've met this person or whether you're still waiting. And I heard timing, yes. It's all in timing. For those of you who are waiting, it's all in timing. And I keep hearing a train and it's like it's getting closer. So the time is coming closer where you are going to meet this person. But you have really done a lot of reflection on your past decisions, on your past relationships. And it's like you are at peace with yourself now. You are finally at peace with yourself you're just at peace with the life. You've done a lot of work. You've done a lot of healing. And now you're ready. You're ready to take this leap of faith. You're ready to move forward into a new connection. Yeah, you're finally ready to give to this. I feel like in the past, the reason why things didn't work out is because you still had some work that must be done, that needed to be done. And, you know, by you experiencing these disappointments, it allowed you to turn the focus onto yourself and do that work, heal, you know, really mend, you know, whatever was in you that was causing you to be attached to relationships that were not of your highest good. So, yes, you've definitely done a lot of work on yourself, Scorpio.
Yes, and you are at peace, and it's like now you are ready. You're finally ready for love because you've done the work. And for a lot of you, I feel like you've already met this person. Yes, it's like there's no need to search any longer. You've met this person. So I heard a friend. For some of you, this is a friend. This is a friend whom um, you have been able to evolve with and take things further and develop a romantic relationship. So let's get one more message. And again, I just hear a train. Like, I just keep hearing a train. So Scorpio is getting really close. Like, if you are waiting, for those of you who are waiting, like, it's just getting closer. It's just like I can hear the train just getting closer and closer. So your time is coming. Yes. Yes, your time is coming. You are getting ready to meet this person soon. I have holy love. Yes. A divine connection, a divine partnership, the person that you have been waiting for. Yes. And I heard prototype. Yes, this is someone who matches all of the qualifications. Yes, they meet all of the qualifications. This person is who you've always desired to be with. And then I have composure. Yes. It's like you waited. For a lot of you, you waited for this moment. You waited for this season. And it's approaching. It's coming. You're finally getting ready to enter a new phase, a new cycle in your life. So I hope that these messages that I put forth resonate. Remember to stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Everyone stay blessed.